It's Samantha. Um, I wanted to jump on here and go over a couple of things that people do talk about uh, about getting dangers and some of the things that people do not talk about or don't know. Um, so one of the big things that I personally I didn't know um, and I'm pretty sure I haven't seen any other uh, denture YouTuber um, bring this up, but I found out from my doctor and from my dentist that when you get all your teeth pulled, it opens up the opportunity for you to have um, a vitamin issue. Uh, so I noticed, and I'm going to lean forward to try to show you, these right here on the sides of my mouth. I thought that that was just, you know, the weather's changing. I thought it was just like chap lips or, you know, those types of things. I tried chapstick. I tried um, lip balm. I tried numerous other things. And it just seemed like the more that I tried, the harder they were and they, were, they wouldn't heal. Um, so I had went to my doctor and I had asked her you know what could be the cause of this and she you know drew blood and ran my blood and she said that my b12 was low so I was thinking well how does my b12 get that low to where it causes sores on the sides of my mouth to where they will not heal so I was talking to her about it and she said that it could be numerous things so it didn't even come to mind that I should bring up oh I had you know all my teeth pulled so could that be um, one of the causes um, I didn't even think about that option um, but I had went to my dentist office because I had to get an adjustment on my upper uh, denture and they said oh you have the b12 spots and I looked at them, I'm like, I'm sorry? And they were like, oh yeah, the spots on the sides of your lips, those are from your B12, aren't they? And I was like, yeah, my doctor actually just told me about that last week. And uh, <laughs> so my dentist said that it's common that if you have dentures or get dentures, your body is changing. You don't have your teeth that take calcium and all kinds of different things. You change your eating habits. You eat things that you never used to eat. You eat things that you used to eat all the time because you had to because you had bad teeth. Um, so with my eating habits changing, my B12 dropped. So they were worse than this. Um, if I can find a picture, I'll put it um, like right here um, to show you guys how they did look. Um, but my dentist recommended that I start taking B12. Um, so I am taking the um, these B12 tablets. And I've been taking them for about two weeks now. Yeah, about two weeks now. And my lips have gotten so much better. Like, they don't hurt anymore. They're not super cracked. Like, they were cracked so bad that it was like an open wound on each side like I was the joker like someone had taken knives and just went like that like that's like they were cut um so I just I couldn't I couldn't open my mouth that wide I couldn't smile and now when I smile I have these little red dots and I'm just trying to get those to heal so I've been using the um lip serum by Blistex the conditioning one um to see if that will uh, help moisturize and get everything healed up faster. Um, I know one thing that a lot of people do talk about and I talk about myself is dry mouth. Um, the job that I do have, I'm constantly talking. So I'm constantly opening my mouth, I'm constantly breathing in and out of my mouth, so my dentures get really dry and so do my tongue. Um, so there are times where I do have to close my mouth and stop talking for a minute and then get it back together. Um, 
I know I kind of look like a hot mess. I have like eyeshadow or uh, mascara on one eye and not the other, but it's because I have completely wiped it off of this eye because I've been rubbing it all day. Um, <laughs> but I, uh, I just wanted to jump on here and let you guys know something that I found out um, that may help you guys if you guys are going through the same issue and you guys notice, you know, the cracks on the sides of your mouth and you've tried chapstick, you've tried Neosporin, because I tried that. <laughs> um, I tried Neosporin, I tried chapstick, lip balm. I tried this before I had to start taking the B12. I tried everything under the sun and I just could not get it to heal. So when I found out about it, I have to, I just had to let you guys know, but I wanted to take the B12 pills and see exactly if that worked and it was helping or if I needed to do a B12 shot because if your B12 is too, too low um, and you can't get it raised with B12 uh, pills, then you will have to take a B12 shot. Um, my sister actually has to have B12 shots um, every month. Um, because her B12 is low, but she also has dentures. I never correlated those, uh, you know, going hand in hand, um, but they do. <laughs> but uh, I just wanted to jump on here and let you guys know that. If you guys have any questions, any um, comments, or anything that you guys would like to know, uh, leave it in the comment section down below. I always put my email address in the description box if you want to message me privately. Also, my Instagram and Snapchat, I'll put those on the screen um, right about here. And then they're also in the description box below. Um, but if you guys are new here, please remember to like and subscribe. I know today I look a hot mess, but uh, I tend to, well, yeah, I tend to always look a hot mess. Uh, there are some days where I actually put forth effort, uh, but today is not one of those days. I'm actually going to edit this, get it up, and then go to bed. Um, so I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. You guys have a great rest of your day.